What's up, YouTube? It's Fizz. In the morning, after a workout, I'm back with another video. What up, snappers? Uh, so yeah, we're gonna dive right into it. Uh, <laughs> this video, I'm gonna go over why I love crying. <laughs> and, uh, we'll go over the various reasons and why I think you should let your emotions go and express yourself and allow yourself to cry and, again, let yourself do it. One, for the most part, I'm happy all the time. So there has to be this other side of me that I feel and that I recognize, hence let it go. And even when I do get necessarily, what crying and sadness to me are kind of like, they're different. Cause when I cry, crying to me, when I actually cry, I'm usually happy. I am happy. So it's actually a really good thing. When I cry, I'm actually, and it gives me a lot of energy and a lot of soul. And it's one of the most in-depth things. There was a little fly that you couldn't see with the naked eye. <laughs> and there was just, um, you know, it was one of the best feelings that I ever had but they come rare and few and far in between. That's why when it comes, I recognize it and I feel it. And before, when I was younger, you know, even though a lot of trauma, traumatizing things happened to me and maybe bad, badful events, negative things, I didn't really cry that much. And I didn't recognize it was a good thing. Also, you know, everyone has this stigma of you shouldn't cry, you're a man. That's all a lie. <laughs> you know, like, I just let it go. It's, it's crazy because, like, I actually, the more that I would cry, because I could control it, I... Like I'm laughing, so like once once I laugh, I basic I'm laughing. I'm not really crying anymore, so it's like an instant reaction, an instant cause and effect, and it feels really good. And it's one of the things you should experience and feel. It's one of the best things. I even get more, almost more energy, more feeling than ever when I cry. And once I start like laughing, um, I guess it's just like I, I'm not crying anymore. But then it's like I don't. I need to cry a little bit more so I can feel it more and not just laugh it off. <laughs> I don't really cry all the time. Not a cry baby. And when I do cry, you know, from the first time, I like to, I am alone as of right now. Um, that's just how it happens. If I was with someone else, I've never experienced like that type of crying with someone else. So I guess I'll keep you updated on that. Again, it's don't listen to everybody else about trying to be a man, da da da. You are a man if you cry. And it's a good way of letting go and it feels good. You have to experience it. Ignoring it's not the answer. And when I do cry, especially now that I know this, like I want to recognize it and I want to feel it. I don't want to hinder it and be completely against it in avoidance of it. So that's why I love crying and I suggest you cry some more, a little more, 
and you feel it, <laughs> cut yourself a little creek so you can put a boat on it, and then maybe you can go on a little canoe. <laughs> Uh, and don't be afraid to tell someone who you're honest with or someone that you trust or that you have a good communication with how you feel about whether it's about them about yourself or about something else because maybe they could help you or you could just you know get it out again it's good to cry you don't have to listen to the stigma the masculine thing <laughs> bottle it up so bottled up you're gonna become a bottle of champagne that someone won the shake on New Year's but didn't come around to it because they were so bottled up with emotions that they never did it <laughs> and they just stayed stiff for the rest of their life <laughs> so snappers don't don't remain stiff either let it go, forgive yourself and let it be. Crying is a great way to let it go. Don't listen to anybody else either and let them brainwash you with their screen, their images, their opinions, and the pressuring, terrorizing you and instigating things. Just let it go. So cry a little bit more and express yourself don't be afraid to be confident that it is manly when you feel if you don't become and you let go of all your feelings then what are you we're made essentially for this life to feel everything so it's a great way to feel <laughs> cry a little more like I said I hope you enjoy the video I don't base nothing off science I base it all off a of fact <laughs> Which is, I just base it off experience. If you have your tall tale, I'd love to hear it. Put it in the comment box below. Subscribe to my channel, of course. You gotta tell these peeps, AKA snappers. The further reach me, I would go into the description box. I'm soon to have a book called Life's a Ride. It just needs revised and put online and published too. It's gonna be online first. Check out my music. I'm gonna have a lot of music coming up really soon. Um, you can also buy some of my self-made music right in the description box below, and you can also contact me further in there. Also, give me a thumbs up if you really enjoy this video and you're gonna cry to the mirror on the wall and ask them who's the most set up, upset of all. And then maybe you'll get into your own fairy tale and enjoy it. <laughs> I don't even know if that's from Cinderella. I just know, like, I remember from Shrek. I think that's where I seen it. <laughs> one, I probably want another one of those movies. I used to, I used to watch Shrek. <laughs> just the replay of the song when I was younger, when the first one came out. I did like the movie, the first one. Um, I used to watch the, just so I can hear that one song, somebody once told me the world was gonna roll me, I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed, she was looking kinda dumb with a finger and a thumb in the shape of an L on a forehead, now you don't stop, <laughs> I used to just replay it on the beast. VHS and like just play that song again <laughs> but like really <laughs> give me a thumbs down if you have no clue what I'm talking about you never watched the movie and VHS were obsolete but you'd still like stick your tongue on one of them to see how it feels even though I never did that <laughs> so that's it snappers let me know how you feel I'm a raw dude, I give raw info. If you have any video requests, I definitely take them. Let me know how you feel. Thanks for tuning in to this video. I highly appreciate it. One take, Drake. No cuts, no editing. Thank you very much. Have a blessed day.